When you're in a hurry and you want bacon, the microwave is your friend. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to cook bacon in the microwave to the texture that you love. For this method, I simply have some paper plates. You're gonna need about two or so paper plates, depending on how thick your plate is, because the bacon grease is going to seep through at the bottom. You may have to do some microwave cleanup, but point being, paper plates, paper towels. I like to place two paper towels or so on top of the plates at the bottom of my bacon. And then you don't want to overcrowd your plate. You want to put a three to four slices of bacon. Now the, this bacon is really thin because my family likes thinly sliced bacon, but the thicker the bacon, the more time is going to require in the microwave. And I'm gonna tell you shortly how to gauge how much additional time you need. So first of all, let's lay out our bacon on top of our paper towels, just like that and you wanna make sure that your bacon is on the paper towel on the plate, like that. And then we take another paper towel and you're going to cover your bacon. A paper towel is usually not big enough to cover all of them, so I kinda place it diagonally and cover the rest. For four slices, I start about two minutes. It's about two minutes for three to four slices. It just really, again, depends on the thickness of your bacon. My bacon's pretty thin, so in the microwave we go. The plate is going to go directly on the platter in your microwave. You are going to add two minutes and cook it through. All right, so it's been two minutes, and like I told you, my bacon is really thin, so it's nearly there. What you want to look out for is a crispy texture on the edges, but you know you need an additional 20 to 30 seconds if the middles are soft like this. For really crispy bacon, this is gonna need an extra 20 seconds or so. Now, when you add incremental time, don't go for a full minute because you'll burn the edges of your bacon. You can also sometimes remove the outer pieces if those are ready to go for you, so you can take them off the plate, use the same paper towel, cover it, and add additional time in the microwave. So these other slices, I've added a little bit extra time. You can also pat them dry with a paper towel. A great thing about cooking bacon on paper plates and using paper towels is that they are automatically absorb a lot of the bacon grease. If you don't wanna use paper towels, you can use, still use a paper plate, use an additional one or two paper plates and they will seep through as well. And then make sure you use another paper plate to cover it. Another idea is to use a microwave safe bowl. That means it's a bowl that's not gonna heat up when you put it in the microwave. And then lay your bacon over the bowl. But I don't like to do that because none of my dishware is microwave safe, so that's not an option. Now if you're wondering, how do I cook bacon in the microwave without using paper towels and paper plates? So there is actually a reusable tray where you can cook bacon available. And I'm gonna make sure I link that right below this video. But with that tray, you're just going to take your bacon slices, place them on the tray, and as the bacon cooks, it's going to drip the grease on the tray. And when it's finished, you just have to remove the bacon from the plastic tray and your bacon is ready to go. If you like easy videos like this one, I share tips with you all the time. Make sure you click that red subscribe button right below this video so you and I get to cook together every single week. See you next time.